Hey, Team Rev. It's so good to be with you today. And I want to share about our word for the week, which is forgiveness. Now, when we think about forgiveness, it's something that everybody has to do at some point in time. And it's something that we all struggle with. But I've discovered some things about forgiveness. Forgiveness is one of the most powerful tools in the world. I remember traveling to South Africa several years ago, and I went to the Nelson Mandela Museum. I went to his home, and I saw a quote that was attributed to him, and it said, unforgiveness is like drinking poison and hoping that your enemy will die. He went on to share in some of his stories about how when he was in prison, at first he was angry against the guards, he was angry against the, the white man and so on. And he said there came a point in time where he forgave everybody. And he said when he forgave everyone, it actually freed him. In one of his conversations with one of the guards, it, it, he ended up befriending the God, and as they had discussions, he began to realize, this guy is just doing his job. This guy is not the, 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 the implementer of racism. He is a victim just as much as me. And sometimes it takes real courage to understand when to forgive and how to execute forgiveness. But I found in my own life that when I forgive, it creates a freedom. Even Jesus said this. Jesus said, forgive and you shall be give, forgiven. So today I want to remind you that no matter what you're going through, no matter who's offended you, sometimes you are able to correct the offense. Sometimes you're, able, you're not able to. But regardless, whatever the situation is, just learn to forgive and your load gets lighter. So today and every day, remember the power of forgiveness. Rev, you and us together.